What is up, YouTube? Um, I want to make this video for everybody out there that is a supporter of mine who's been watching me over the last seven years. You know, I was sitting down with some very, very close friends of mine that I grew up with. And we were just talking and they had not done so, so I ended up just sitting here just watching TV and whatnot. Um, I started to think that yes, I may be broken. Yes, I may be hell. But I want to make this video for the supporters out there that have helped me get this far. Even in my darkest of times, you guys cannot disappoint. Ever. Whether, you know, whether you're old fans, you know ones, I want you guys to know that I love each, that I love each and every single one of you guys. Because what I'm dealing with, I would never wish on anyone in my whole entire life. I really wouldn't. I would never wish what I've been through on anyone. Because what I've been through is, it's not okay. It's horrific. It's traumatizing. It mentally and physically and emotionally destroys you. And it can tear your whole life apart in a matter of minutes. My life has not been easy for the last seven years. My life has been very difficult. And you know, I know that I have supporters out there that love and care. And like I said, I appreciate each and every single one of you guys. I really do. This life that I've had to live is not one that I ever wanted to live. For the last ten years, I have been living a life of fear. I have been living a life of being scared. I have been living a life of not knowing what to do. And it's not been easy. Like I said, I want to get back to who I used to be before 2017. I want to be that person again so fucking goddamn bad. That's all I ever dream about every day is being that person again that I used to be. Being that person that was normal. Being that person that was doing music videos that was doing short films, that was doing artwork, that was creating and selling my own merchandise, that was selling my music, that was doing gameplay videos, that was having fun. That's the person that I want to be again so bad. And hopefully with the help that I'm going to be getting started tomorrow, hopefully Hopefully all that will change and hopefully I can get the help. I need to get back to being that person. Because I want to be better for myself, for my family, and for my friends. But most importantly for my girlfriend and my two stepsons who I love more than life itself. I want to be better for them, all of them. Most importantly, I want to be better for you guys. The fans that actually want to see me do well. The fans that want to see me succeed, I want to do better for you guys. 
Because like I said, this life that I've had to live, it's not easy. Always being scared, always being depressed, not knowing what to do. It's been hard. It's been very, very hard. It's been very difficult for me, for my family, for my friends. And I know it's been even harder for you guys, the supporters who want to support me. But get scared away because of the trolls threatening your lives, threatening your jobs. Like I said before, I know I'm not perfect. No one in this world is. I've made my fair share of mistakes, but I'm here trying to right those wrongs. I'm here trying to fix those wrongs every single day of my life. And one thing that I've learned in all this is you can either be held back by your past or you can break away from it. And I want to break away from my past and do better. Because I know that the trolls and the people that truly hate me that think that I'm evil and I'm not, they're going to have their opinions. They're going to do whatever it takes to stop me. But... I am getting the help I need to try to combat this. To combat the demons that I face every day. To try to do better. And hopefully to try to put a stop to all this. I don't deserve this. My family and friends don't deserve it. My girlfriend and our kids don't deserve it. And you guys, the fans, you guys especially don't deserve it. Because all you guys want to do is show love and support for me, and you guys can't. Because you guys are constantly being threatened, constantly being attacked. And it's not fair to you guys. It's really not. Like I said, I understand that I've made my fair share of mistakes. Some worse than more. You know, some way worse than others. And I get that. But that doesn't mean I don't deserve a chance to try to fix things. I understand the way that I went about it may not have been the right way. But I'm here now wanting to do it the right way. Wanting to get better, wanting to put a stop to this so I can do myself again. Because since 2017, not only have I been getting robbed of a life that I fought so hard for, but you guys, the fans, the real supporters out there, even though there might not be many of you, I know you guys are still out there. And I feel like if you guys have gotten robbed of watching somebody that you guys care about, succeed. I got robbed of a life, and you guys got robbed of wholesome, meaningful, fun content that I could have been creating this whole time. Instead of watching me do wholesome, creative, fun content, you guys have to watch me struggle and fight every day, and I'm tired of it. So I promise you guys, to the fans, that I'm going to do everything I can to get better for you guys, for my friends, for my family, for my girlfriend and our two sons. But most importantly, I want to get better for myself and for you guys. So starting tomorrow, I may or may not be on as much. I don't know yet. I'm still working on things, trying to figure out what I want to do and what's going to happen when I start my treatment starting tomorrow. So, yeah, just know that I will be posting as much as I can. I will be doing as much 
content as I possibly can. Uh, I am going to try to do more gameplay videos. I am definitely going to try to do that a lot more. Um, and, uh, yeah. So, if you guys see any changes, you know, the name change, the rebranding, the newer, you know, gameplay videos, I hope that you guys will be here still to support that journey in my life. Because I want to rebrand, I want to do better for myself. For you guys, for my friends, and for my family, and for my girlfriend and my two kids who I love more than anything in this world. I want to do better for all of you. And starting tomorrow, I'm going to be working on that as much as humanly possible. Like I said, I'm going to be rebranding the channel. I'm going to be going under a whole new life because I do not want to be connected to the Cyrax now anymore. The Cyrax now is meaningless to me. The only thing that that reminds me of is the dark chapters in my life that I did not want to be a part of. All I see when I hear the name Cyrax is somebody that I do not recognize. Because I do not recognize that person that I was. I know it was me, but I, I don't recognize myself in all those videos. Because that person that made me out to be was not mine. That wasn't the real me. That was somebody that the troll community molded. And bred out to be that way. And grow to be that way. But that's not who I am as a person. That's not who I want to be. I want to be the real me again. The real me that got lost in time. Due to the trolling. Due to the attacks. I want to be better and I want to do better. But instead of talking about it, I want to show you guys. That I can do better. And that I am going to do better. Which for many means I will not be going on any channels. At all. I'll be sticking to my own content. I will not be responding to any intro at all. I will not be responding to those three people who I will not mention by name because they do not deserve the recognition, but they know who they are. I will not be watching their videos. I will not be going on their panels. I am going to be avoiding them like the black plague. I do not even want to hear about what they're doing. And I said it's absolutely important. If they're making videos on me or restreaming my videos, oh fucking well, I don't care. I truly don't care. The only time I want to be alerted by them is that they're planning on doing something to me or my family. And that is it. Because starting tomorrow, I'm going to start going about this the right way by getting myself help. And through that help, hopefully I can start to make a change in my life and a change in this situation as a whole. So with that being said, to all my fans out there, I love you guys so much. I can't thank y'all enough for helping me get this far. I just know, like I said, this is not the end. I am not retiring. I am just shutting down and rebranding and re-upping everything as a whole so that I can start a new chapter in my life and start to build something that I can be proud of. But with that being said, I love you guys. and I will see you guys when the channel is rebranded and I start posting new content. I love you guys. Peace.